How can a bad drug or defective medical device be determined? The attorneys at Benstershive Law Group explain. There are three main ways in which a bad drug or device can be labeled as defective, making the manufacturers responsible for your injuries, pain, and suffering. The first one is called defective design and occurs when the drug or device is dangerous because of the way it was created. This means that the manufacturer failed to take into account the safety of the customer, when they could have used a safer approach to the design of the product in order to prevent a possible future risk. For example, a bad drug can result in severe side effects, or a medical device might fail at some point in time when it shouldn't have. The second one is defective manufacturing and occurs when a drug becomes defective during its manufacturing phase. Use of the wrong substances or materials or failure to apply necessary quality controls may result in defective manufacturing, which can ultimately lead to patient injuries. This can include faulty or completely ignored manufacturing steps, damage or contamination in the shipping process or errors in the doctor's office. The last one is called defective marketing and occurs when the advertising of a certain drug or medical device failed to warn you of possible dangers associated with its use. The manufacturer of the product is obliged by law to warn customers of potential side effects that can make the product dangerous. Failure to provide adequate instructions concerning safe usage and overall bad marketing of the product are directly related to defective marketing. For a free phone consultation, contact attorneys at Fenstershive Law Group PA in Hollandale Beach, Florida today. With the right legal team behind you, Fenstershive Law Group PA will fight the system with you to get the compensation you are legally entitled to.